welcome youtube peeps marvin here once again i'm gonna do a um i'm gonna do a thing on the john ruder 3500 this is the truck here uh, you can get it on um, dlc uh, it's 25 dollars and i think it is well worth the money um, I, i've got a friend to help me do the livery on it which you can see here uh, as i say there are some free trucks out there but they're not very good guys they aren't very good so without further ado let's jump jump in and let's show you what we're going to do first of all we're going to show you what trailers um, this will do uh, so if I go to um, trader purchase and then if I go to uh, John Ruder so these are the two trucks that you can get for John Ruder. So one of them is a obviously is a um, is a car transporter, and the other is basically uh, you can haul beams, you can haul uh, JCBs, you can haul mini diggers, and everything else. But you can do Swan Neck if you can get a swan neck trailer like this one any swan neck trailer will fit this truck but be aware it's the weight of the um, trailer so you really want to choose a small one you don't really want to choose a big one so I just thought I'd show you that because there are quite a few trailers that you can use these trailers here is another lot of set of trailers these will do cattle these will do um these will do chickens sheep etc etc even pigs as well i'm not quite sure what this one is for this one is looks like it's for decorative purposes only but these three i know they do work but as i say look for small swan neck trailers don't overburden your truck and you will be fine you will be fine let's jump in and let's show you what i've been doing so at the moment i've just done a cattle um a cattle run um and all you've got to do basically is go to uh, the job market and find the cattle um in your area now you you might not be close to uh that cattle area so you might have to travel to it um, another thing I really want to bring your attention to is the fuel tank. The fuel tank is only 367, um, can only take you 350, 367 miles. It's only a 50 gallon capacity tank. So plan your routes and as, again you will be fine. So if we go to this one, I'm going to do a short haul. So I think I'm going to do the sheep here at the moment. So that's only a hop, skip and a jump down the road. So let's take this one. Um, I've changed, guys. I've changed what I've... Um, my head tracker now. I have now got a Toby eye tracker, which is a Toby eye tracker and head tracker combined. It is really, really brilliant it's a nice piece of kit um, the developers of these is a Swedish company uh, they also do um, basically they accommodate for anyone who is disabled and if you remember Stephen Hawkins who was well he wasn't disabled to begin with but he had that disease where he couldn't speak anymore he used the Toby eye tracker to look at words string sentences along with those words and that is how he could talk a lot of people thought it was um it wasn't him talking it was a persona voice that w was made up for to get him to talk so there you go so i'm going to stop the truck i'm going to load it I'm going to load it up and then what we're going to do is we're going to we are going to jump in when I can find my feet 
as I say, I really do like this truck. Uh, if you are new to ATS or ETS, now you can get this, you can get this mod for either ATS or ETS. And if you're just starting out in the game, um, buy the box standard, um, buy the box standard uh, DLC. Look around for a DLC uh, and buy this one because this will give you short hauls. Um, so what we're we do is we'll pull out here. We'll get back into the truck. I'm going to be looking for somewhere to fuel up. I've got 305 miles to go, but this is what I would suggest you do, guys. Plan your plan your route. So. I'm looking for a next available petrol station, which could be this one here. And then what we do is we do a bypass around there and then we go to our destination. So that's what I'm going to do. So nice piece of kit. Left turn ahead. I strongly turn recommend left. this guys, I really do. I wouldn't I would not be YouTubing and I would not be streaming this if this was not a decent piece of kit and trust me guys this is really 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 nice piece of kit turn right the truck is basically manageable you can do exactly the same in ATS what you can do in ETS I'm just looking so I don't let me get back into first view Oh, we've got the coppers here. Mind your P's and Q's. The fuzz are around. So you can accessorise this to your heart's content. I've got Fred here, me Alsatian, or German Shepherd Dog, whatever you want to call them. Um, and as I say, the cabin, the cabin is really, really brilliant. Um, I've got my furry dice. I've got the fan there keeping Fred cool. Really nice sound to the truck as well. Um, you can accessorize the wheels, the tires, exactly the same as what you can do with the uh, with the trucks in ATS and ETS to your heart's content. Um, you can get this this truck that I'm in now. And you do not have to be any level. You can get it at zero level. Now, some of the other trucks, you have to be level five. Uh, but this one, you don't. You can be zero. So as long as you've got the money, you can buy it. Are we going down here? No, we're going down the next one, aren't we? Yeah, we're going down the next one. Left turn ahead. Neither went down the wrong turn in there, guys. Turn left. Let me put my dinkler on. I've got the extendable uh, wing mirrors as well, so you can act if your if your trailer is a little bit long, you can put the extended mirrors on, and jobs are good and job is a good one. Let me put my winker on. Let me just check. And oh, we've got a fast moving bogey there. So I've spent a lot of time with my moderator doing deliveries on this because I've done all the artwork myself um, and my uh, my moderator Will 6x2 he actually did all the stuff on putting it into the game uh, I have no clue how to do that uh, someone's just earned me some money which is good Uh, we got 28 miles to go, so I've got plenty of fuel. I don't even need to uh, fuel up, guys. But I will do. I will fuel up. Uh, because if we're going to pick up another job from where we're going to deliver these, uh, we might not have a garage which will be close. So it's always best to plan your routes. Plan your routes and you'll be fine. Um, I have actually turned uh, the in the settings. I've turned off diversions 
because diversions for me are a pain in the posterior because if you've got a low amount of fuel and uh, you've got a diversion and sometimes it will take you on a great big loop and by the time you come back the AI have not cleared that diet that um, obstruction and you are snookered so I've temporarily turned them off keep right then take the exit right so we keep him right and we're going to take the exit right so let me put my winker on we're going take to cut, the cross right. the carriageway um, and w this is where we're going to pick up the uh, this is where we're going to pick up the fuel so we're going to turn right left sorry got my left and right mixed up there turn left Fred you're in the way man duck <laughs> My dog's in the way, I can't see. Oh, he's going to let me... No, he's not going to let me out. I thought you was going to let me out then. Oh, my God. Let's see whether we can push here. Yes, mate. You're bibbing at me, but I can't I can't go if the road's not clear. Nompty breath. Freaking bibbing at me. I don't know. Impatient drivers. You get them in the game and you get them in real life. <clears throat> Excuse me. So there will be a link in the description to not only the John Ruder site, so you can have a Let's look at this uh, mod. Uh, there will be a link in the description for my um, for my Twitter, or as Turn I call left. it, Twitter. Uh, also, I am a streamer, guys. I'm an eclectic streamer, and I do stream these ga this game. Turn ahead. And I do stream um, European right. Truck Simulator as well. Oh, lights are against us. I think we can turn, actually, if I remember American Truck Simulator. We can turn this way. Um, I also play quite a few games as well, so do check me out, guys. Do check me out. Oh, I must have me. Um, I must have my full beam on. Someone keeps on flashing at me. So let's go and pick up some petrol because we'll probably need it when we come on the flip. It's always best to keep topping up. I know I get ribbed in the stream by people going, Marvin, you can get to your situation where you're going. You don't need to top up your fuel. I always do because if there is a diversion, um, you can, you've got to plan it. You have got to plan these things. Because if you don't, you're going to be snookered. And then you're going to be getting the recovery out to get you out of a sticky situation. So let's just pull forward and let's just show you this truck. That's been charged. As you can see, I've got the cows in the back, guys. The cows are in the back. Let me show you the cows. So the cows are all in the back. <laughs> That was the cat. That was me. Wasn't the cows? If you come to a situation like this, guys, if you keep pushing, make sure you don't get your car twatted. Though, keep pushing, and then some AI might be nice and friendly like this one, and he might let you out. Thank you, sir. You're so, right such ahead. a gentleman. Such a gentleman turn you are. Right. I think this little mod is, as I say, it's very, very good. I know I'm sounding like a broken record, but it gives you a different spin on American Truck Simulator and European Truck Simulator. Because you don't like, I like to do diversity things as well. I don't just like doing trucking and stuff like that. I like Turn to do left. a nice little spin on, tr on things. I'll wait for all these to turn.
don't know what he stopped there for. I think he's lost. <laughs> he's lost. Really nice sounding truck, this one as well. Um, I have got another mod called the Ford F350. I think it's three, no, 3, 350. And I'm not being, I'm not being funny, guys. It was only $10, and some of the stuff is glitching out on it. The front wheels are glitching out when you try, when you actually do um, change the front wheels. This one is Bob on, and is well worth. And I keep on chirping on about it. It is well worth the $25. Keep right, then um, turn right. They are updating things on a month-to-month -month basis. Right. They are open to suggestions as well. So if you want to, if you want to join, uh, they haven't got a Discord at the moment, but I will put a link in the description. Uh, there is like a little chat area where you can chat to them. Can I go? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna, I'm gonna chance it, and I'm gonna go. So you can actually chat to them. Um, and you can ahead. ask them questions uh, and I think that's really really good when you can actually ask them questions and you don't I mean if you want to sign up for it sign up for it but I don't think when I first um, started to chat I don't think I signed up for you it but your it's well worth it it is well worth it right we've reached our destination guys so what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna reverse in I'm actually gonna pull straight forward because time for the YouTube to be cut down. So if I was streaming, I probably would actually reverse this in, but I'm not going to. Someone's left that trailer in an obscure place, didn't they? So let's just pull that in there now. Let's pull that into the area. Bish bash bosh. Winner winner chicken dinner. And as I say, I'll give you another look at it. It is really really good guys it is really really good now your own trailer so you've got to stop the engine and push the empty button twice and then there you go excellent boom four grand winner winner chicken dinner that's me mcmarvin um as i say guys do look at the description do follow me on on twitter do follow me on twitter uh, i'd really like you to give me a thumbs up if you want to like and subscribe that'd be brilliant guys and i will catch you in the next one take care stay safe everybody and i'll see you later